how to create and send an invoice using PayPal hello guys and welcome to this new tutorial today I'm going to show you how you can create your own invoice in PayPal and send it to your customer for example or for your freelancer or for any case that you want to use and send a the invoice for the first thing that you have to do is to go to paypal.com you have to have an account if you don't have an account yet on paypal all you need to do is to click on the sign up you can choose either you have a business account or to create a business account or a personal account it is up to you to choose uh, from them then you have to continue then you put your email your um, phone number etc etc and you will get the uh, great uh, sign up uh, with it now since I have a email address I will uh, go with or an account I will go with the login a little disclaimer guys everything created in this video are created for the sake of the video they are not used uh, for personal uses such as email addresses um, uh, names and everything uh, like this uh, especially addresses and etc etc now I will put in my code then I will connect to my PayPal and be there in a second after I have put my code it will redirect me directly to the uh, dashboard of PayPal this is the dashboard of PayPal as you can see we are in the home page we can send and request payments uh, like this when you click on it you can send payment you can uh, search for a user then uh, send a payment you can send an, an invoice from uh, this section you can request a payment you can contact see your contacts and you can create an invoice you can see your wallet right here you can uh, see that uh, you have a PayPal balance we have a problem with the uh, balance right here or the uh, page now let's go back to the subject which is the creation of the invoice when you go back to the home page of PayPal all you need to do is to click on create an invoice like this now in this case it will uh, be directing or making a time to load uh, this is the a uh, uh, the uh, loading or this is the uh, invoice creation page uh, for this case I will go and the hide some information then I will let you show, see what I have hi hidden so we will get and hide your information as well now I have hidden my information so you can see that the invoice is uh, nearly empty it has it contains only the name and the uh, last name you can see here the previewer of the invoice this is the PDF version this is the mobile preview version for example select a payment method you can send this invoice to someone and make the pay make them pay the uh, amount that you are uh, making them uh, the email preview this is uh, the, the invoice that we will get for example for the uh, employee or the clients for example uh, and now for who are you billing you can uh, create for example a new customer you can name it uh, like this for example or make Jack for the sake of the video since it is uh, making a lot of uh, uh, noises now I will go with uh, this uh, email address this is a fake email address uh, it is created for the video they are not real I will click on add like this it will add the email you can add more recipient if you want you can select or type an email address then you can confirm it uh, what are they paying for this is a very famous question you can set a item for example create an item it, it, this item can be a goods or can be a services for example uh, you are a freelancer and want to get paid from your client so you send them this invoice for example you can uh, name it service uh, you can make it a service fee or make a services fee you can for example type service services fees for example like this you can put uh, the hours of your working for example you have to, you've worked two hours the rate of the hour is 
for example 15 or 18 dollars the currency you can set the currency uh, on your days for example you have you want to uh, make a currency of USD that is up to you now for the description it is optional but you can make a little description for the uh, clients that will pay you of course so they will get a better understanding what they are paying for for example this is an invoice to make the for example payment payment of my services that I have provided you for example provided you with um, and this is the example of the description you add the description as it is you can see here the uh, where's the description it is right here this is an invoice yes the uh, preview is right here you can see the invoice in the PDF right here this is bill to Jack the address of the um, bill to the item and this is the description the amount of hours I have worked for the average uh, fee that I have to charge for client per hour like this and the subtotal and the total now this is the uh, total you can make add a payment terms for example you can allow the tip uh, allow partial payment you can uh, allow uh, some partial payment I will allow the tip and now for the uh, subtotal you can add charges for example you can make a discount you can create a discount you can uh, put a an uh, other amount for example you can add a discount uh, like this value for example two dollars discount name uh, thing uh, thanks like this you can add the discount for example thanks you can go with it this is a discount that you will put for example if you have made a deal with the client that you will give him a discount of two dollars that uh, everything that will be noted right here in the subtotal then here the uh, notes and attachments you can add some notes to your customer you can add terms and conditions reference number memo to yourself you can attach a file now for the more actions that you have you can share the link of the uh, invoice you can save the draft edit the business info this is where i have hidden my information phone number email address and everything in the uh, I have uh, mentioned before here you can add for example if you have a company and want uh, to put uh, your logo you can directly put the logo on the invoice then save it the invoice will be like this it will contain always the um, the logo except for the email uh, version and all you have to do for example is to send it directly that was all for today's video. Thank you guys for watching and see you on the next one.